Hello everyone, I am Vijay Vashak. In this video, I am going to show how to implement secure file system server. That's been we are uh, uh, we are going to implement a lock sign. Uh, our initial state status wa was not secure, but I will uh, co construct the secure file system server. Uh, so first, so first of all. I uh, I already created a a server uh, created a Django server uh, in this command uh, sudo python3 manage dot migrate uh, this is a first this is my first command and then uh, uh, run my server this command okay uh, I already implemented it uh, so I am demonstrate it now. Uh, next in the next step uh, I am going to uh, this command going to run this command and now I am discussing uh, step by step those command so uh, at the first uh, we need to configure DNS server uh, configure DNS server uh, we uh, normally uh, uh, we normally execute this command sudo apt install bind 9 and uh, this com by this command uh, th uh, by this command we configure dns server and uh, in the next command sudo apt install dictionary uh, uh, dns suite tils in this command and after that we need to um, we need to run this command sudo nano etc name dot conf uh, in this command we need to create a uh, name server and uh, uh, we create a file system and we create a file system uh, named name server here is the file system uh, etc control f name uh, here is this file we need to create here is uh, we create the port number is 53 uh, directory but name bar name localhost 192 168.0.24 uh, this command uh, this by this command and uh, next we show dig.google.com and that's why our server is worked or not in this command so we see that our server is worked google.com is worked after that we see we see ns.look up google.com by this server we see that our server 127.0.0.1 is worked and at this is hash 53 which is our port number uh, in the next in the next command we need to enable we need to enable our named named server it is system control enable name server and in this file we uh, we create we create our uh, we create our we create our dns enable validation look side and etc and we uh, create here some included file and uh, etc uh, after that after that we uh, I we need to start system control start name which is created name and we need to start it and in this in we create another file uh, which uh, the local DNS server be, because that local DNS server works as uh, caching server uh, we have to working as the complete lookup and name resolving server and next it uh, it let us create a zone file uh, our um, zone file was uh, acme secure server dot com and after that we uh, after that we can see the answering section was acme secure server dot com and this is this was uh, this is uh, replaced by 127.1.1.1 so now we can see 127.1.1 replaces by acme server.com okay 
now okay uh, uh, in the next step uh, we in the next step uh, we need uh, yes in next step we need to configure the certificate with open SSL uh, now uh, I am showing these steps uh, now we need to make three directory uh, in this command we make we make three directory already I have uh, made uh, those directories so it shows file exist uh, next we make to uh, uh, we need to make some subfolder those already I uh, created so it shows a file exist now uh, we uh, now I create uh, task uh, task with task command and a the file of index Here is the index file up root of ca and sub ca in this folder we can see root index file and sub ca into the sub ca here is the index file okay <coughs> In the next, uh, uh, in the next, uh, we open, we run open SSL, uh, open SSL gen RSA. We use uh, AES two fifty six encryption. Uh, then we generate root CA, <coughs> root CA, uh, uh, acme root CA and sub CA. Uh, the local private key which is uh, which can be done using uh, GS, uh, G, gen rsa algorithm gen rsa command here is number one command in here we need uh, to uh, password for the private uh, key here is the second command and here is the third command line and then we go to uh, root ca and then uh, we need to move the CA directory and create top level certificate for the CA from the previous generated key and CA dot uh, CA dot CA root CA dot conf uh, configuration file will be needed to directory then sorry we need then we configure here the acme root ca the common name then we use this command uh, this command uh, 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 we will be asked for some information country code here and state common name the common name is very uh, critical and it should be set we want to domain be here and i have named this root acme root ca and then we can view the certificate using this command open ssl x509 something here is our rsa public key 4096 byte bit here is the key here is a signature algorithm which is r256 encryption rs encryption then we change the directory uh, sub ca then we need to be configure sub ca dot conf here sub ca sub ca dot conf uh, we already created this file previously we create this file here is the source code then then we change the directory here already set and now uh, uh, this is the our configuration ser uh, server and they, now we need to sign <coughs> uh, sign our certificate here uh, we change the directory and uh, here the RAND serial argument is necessary generate a random serial for the certificate being signed 
it should be uh, noted that some requirement information uh, for signing the certificate property are also inside the dot com dot file uh, it has already created then uh, then we generate uh, a sub CA this no 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 not this file okay okay uh, then after that after that uh, we configure the private key and certificate for the server and a server.com file will be needed uh, here serve server con file there we need it we already created server dot con file here here is the server dot con file we already created and we use here dns1 acme server dot com and dns2 www dot acme server dot com and here is the local host the port is 8086 uh, next next we oh, next we run next uh, we just go we need to configure our local server to use this generate ser, uh, server certificate and the uh, intermediate certificate is to verify it uh, here I am use uh, Django server to uh, use Django server and first we need to install some new packages here is the one package uh, sudo pip install uh, pi open SSL and next command uh, next command is sudo pip install django ssl server and uh, then we need to copy the server private key we copy the server private key server private key and sign certificate root ca sign certificate into it say this this two files we need here is our server file we paste here just copy and paste here server uh, uh, sorry we missed it uh, we missed it uh, we um, sorry I uh, I uh, attach our um, uh, I attach or uh, a uh, two file in chain.crt name as chain.crt here is the crt file and we also need to copy and paste the crt chain.crt file in the server and now i am going to restart i am going to restart our uh, restart our uh, main server let's see here is our old server oh, great we can stall no uh, we can run with a uh, private key this run server we need to say the give the password and here is not secret but we can act a td ts here is our server and here is lock uh, we see the lock file the connection issue certificate we can see the certificate details uh, we can see here the certificate is valid fire key fingerprint sha 256 is fingerprint here is the certificate details here is the fingerprint issued by acme now we can see our encryption and decryption file is work or not we choose a file here is a one picture select upload just upload this file and download it sorry we need to we need to run 
our wire shark Check our oil shark. Any host start here. We filter our IP address equals to one twenty seven dot one dot one dot one. This is our IP, and we upload choose a file, upload a picture upload Hazer file now we can download so download save as image save now if we show this image so this image our image is right no show and now we can check our is our IP hot Now we check our TLS, uh, our, uh, we check in Wireshark, uh, is uh, our uh, service is secure or not. Uh, we choose a file, this picture, upload. Now we download it, control image save as PNG file, save. Now we open it. We can see our picture is right, no issue. Now we check our wire shark. So if stop it, if we check here TLS is okay. We see the TLS, 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 here TLS version 1.2 TLS. So our uh, connection is secured and it's okay. Uh, now in the next step we uh, in the next step now we uh, i revoke the certificate issue and to acme server.com uh, now i showed it 